thought I'd go through some aspects of the SH101 as well. And this is going back to LFO. So on the left hand side here you've got the modulator. I've only got my shadow there as well. Uh, okay, so there's the your rate control and you've got the various waveforms available there, triangle, square, random and noise. Okay, mod, modulation, that's the VCO for the pitch. Um, if you set the pulse width to LFO, then it controls the pulse width. Obviously, you can only have the square wave for it to work. Um, there's your source mixer, the different waveforms and the sub oscillator. And then here we've got mod under the filter. So, like the envelope generator, you have to close the filter first of all in order for it to work. Um, but the other thing that's also very interesting is on this on the amplifier, you've got a setting. My hand will stop shaking. You can see LFO on the left-hand side. Uh, trying to get some focus on this. Right. Okay. Whatever. I think you can see it there. There's now if you set that to LFO the envelope, then that means the envelope settings are creating the shape of the cycle. And as long as you're on envelope here, um, on the amplifier, then it works. Anyway, so I'll show you. First of all, um, let me set it to gate. So I um, press the hold button, which you'll need for the arpeggiator as well. So, okay. Uh, right, set that to gate and modulator up. Okay, so the, what is changing the filter settings is the modulator. Okay, we're on the square wave there now. 